Hi, and welcome on our YouTube channel. This is Team Spin and Cast, and you are currently watching the first episode of our new fishing series, Fishing Switzerland. Later this year, Tielmo drove into the beautiful canton of Ticino. For about a week, he fished in the sheer endless amount of rivers and lakes. Not only are there tons of rivers and small streams to fish, but these rivers are also the home of yet small, but extremely beautiful brown trout. The colors of these beautiful little fish are insane. The red spots are truly remarkable. You won't find any fish like this around the world, so we do our best to not harm these precious little creatures. So without much further say, let's move on with the first part of Brown Trout in Ticino. Fishing with little twitch baits is extremely fun. Combined with ultralight fishing gear, it makes up a perfect fishing experience. And for the first time in this episode, we call it Fish On. Those little trout are insane fighters, even in these small streams. It really gets your heart racing when you see a trout chasing down your bait and trying to eat it. And there she goes. Losing a fish is extremely common when fishing with this kind of baits. So don't get too frustrated when you lose a fish or two, it happens to us all the time. Fishing in water is clear can be very fun and exciting, but you have to keep in mind that the increase in visibility can cause in less bites. You're not the only one seeing that good, the trout can get very shy in such clear water. So you have to be very careful when approaching new spots. But if you end up hooking into a trout, there's nothing better than seeing the trout attack your bait. I'm always impressed how fast these fish actually attack. Like the fish, nature in Ticino also is extremely beautiful. Stunning waterfalls turn into blue slow creeks and rivers. The water is so clear it's pretty much safe to drink. A landscape like this is unique and we want it to be like this forever. You won't be able to see the true beauty of this region if you don't hike for several hours. Most of the streams are not fishable because of the steep canyons that the water has formed over thousands of years. There are not lots of fish, but if you find some, they happen to be very, very beautiful and grown up in the nature. Now, if you look at that trout, for example, the white line on its fin is extremely beautiful and the color pattern itself is unique. The color pattern of a trout is like a human fingerprint. There are similar patterns but you won't find the same pattern ever again. So that's about it for the first part of episode 1 in our new fishing series Fishing Switzerland. We kindly thank you for watching and hope you will soon tune in again when it's time for the next part of Fishing Switzerland, Brown Trout in Ticino. <laughs>